Hello everybody, Gamer Petty here bringing you another episode of our Lord of the Rings Online Let's Play. And we are back with Baird Beam. Um, and I'm here at the Quest Giver, but before we talk to him, I want to address something really quick. Because uh, I showed off the virtues in the last episode and there were um, a couple people who had a comment that these are really, really lower than where they need, they should probably be at, at our level. Um, like, I think they said it should be around, like, 33 at the level we're at. Um, I'm, I'm not gonna go back indeed right now. I'm not gonna worry about these too much, uh, until it becomes an issue and it starts feeling like we're missing stuff out here. Um, you get experience for this by doing the deeds, and obviously we have missed a ton of deeds. Um... Like 2,000 virtue experience, 2,000 virtue experience. Yeah, we, I mean, we could get a lot and, and level these up right now. That's not how I want to spend my time <laughs> right now. Um, I love this game and I love, you know, playing it. And sometimes I get into moods to really like no life it and go back and do some of, some of that stuff. Right now is not one of those times. Um, I, I want to play through the story and I want to progress and see where it takes us and you know maybe in Mirkwood we'll do some deeds or maybe in Rohan we'll do some deeds and go back a little bit later uh right now I'm not gonna worry about it and we probably won't worry about it until or unless it becomes an issue um we're doing fine that is you know a big thank you to you know the person that made all of our gear here um that it's gonna it's gonna taper off <laughs> it definitely is I and mean, it's probably gonna start to feel a little bit you know harder at some point uh right now we're fine and we'll worry about that when we get there so just want to give you a, a heads up on that i want to thank you for pointing that out to me though um so if you are playing the game you know make sure you're doing your deeds and keeping these up i think we i mean this is the only one that's even remotely close um but yeah the other ones are kind of low uh you are you are absolutely right uh but like i said we'll worry about that if and when we come to it so again thank you for pointing out okay let's continue on with the uh main story begun here i wonder if you would not wish to be part of the first crossing uh, you have come at last Baird beam i'd begun to wonder if you would not wish to be part of the first crossing but i am pleased to see this is not so see you the river anduin its currents are strong though this be a calm enough place to cross and once we land on the far shore, we will need to be ready for anything. The landing may be uneventful, but then it may be tumultuous indeed. It will be up to Fyrgam on the other side of Anduin to ensure that all goes as smoothly as it may. Once we are secure on the beaches, I will arrange for a second crossing to bring the company that will escort our prisoner to Dol Guldur. Are you ready to travel upon the first boat to cross? Speak with Kalingoth down at the docks if you are ready. Yeah, dude, I'm ready. Uh, down at the docks. Oh, just straight. Straight this way. Okay, cool. Um, yeah, because, uh, just to, you know, talk about it a little bit more. <laughs> um, I don't think deeding right now, like in the middle of the story, would make for good episodes. Uh, it's more filler than anything. Less, let, less let's play. Um, Maybe if we get to a certain level and we're all expecting that we'll be deeding. And then I don't want to play this game a whole lot off camera. Uh, I'm Like I said, I go through almost like mood swings with MMOs. And right now, I'm enjoying playing it for you guys. Wow, that is beautiful. Um, I'm not really into playing it off camera right now. I'm on a big Final Fantasy kick, so... Um... Wait, this is it, right? What news from abroad? Oh. I'm sorry, but I told your friend that Golden Ho that the Golden Host is beginning a dangerous assault. I will not be responsible for his well being. He would be better served remaining behind and writing in Oh, this is the bingo boffin. Okay. Uh, and writing in relative safety. What is this? You hand Kalangoth the note from Failrun, and he looks at it with surprise. Well I cannot say I agree with Failrun's assessment, but this parchment does uh, relieve me of any responsibility should anything happen to Bingo within the forest. I will no longer prevent him from crossing into Mirkwood, 
but know that you will need to survive the landing and do as the Golden Host commands before Bingo will be free to explore. Gain access to Markwood by completing Book 9. Here, we got it. Be wary, traveler. If you're ready to Orcs cross, have come down from the yeah, mountains. yeah, yeah, yeah. If you're ready to cross the Anduin with the first coming board, the boat. Oh, do I just? Oh. <laughs> okay, cool. Well, I'm glad we still talked to him. All right, I need my pals because it is dark and scary here. That's the last time we'll see something beautiful for a while. All right, we made it to Merkwood. Uh. Awesome. Now I have played all the way through Merkwood. Standing is too low. Um. But do I remember any of it? Not not particularly. Is there a horse here? No. Alright, let me take let me take a look at this map for a second here. So no horse here. The closest one would be up here. Really? There's no horse, like, up front? Ooh. Huh. So how do you get from here to Rohan? Where's Rohan in, in, um... Wait, is this new? I don't- I don't even know what's going on anymore. <laughs> um, oh, Ro Rohan's like all the way down here. Okay, I- I don't know. <laughs> I- I don't know. Let's just play. Um, lots of quests. Do we want to pick up some? What do we want to accomplish out here? And is this still... Ended with Aurigian, Forchel, Angmar, Evendim. Where's Markwood? Here's Lothlorien, Moria. This is southern Markwood, right? Yes. I haven't done that either. Okay, um. We gotta discover the deed here. That means we should probably do some quests. I probably want to do... I don't know, let's discover some deeds first and then we will... decide how we know when we're done with Merkwood. Because we're technically done. <laughs> we've, we've advanced our level. Oh, we're on an expedition. We should do all these because once the expedition's over, uh, these will go away, so I, I will do all these ones. Kind of like the beginning of Moria. Uh, and, ooh, and it's gonna give us some reputation tradables, so. A fine day for battle, do you not agree, Baird Beam? In any case, Freergim has asked me with ensuring, uh, or has tasked me with ensuring that we are not taken unaware from the south. There's a small river there, and a f with a few bridges leading to orc encampments on the far side. We cannot spare the forces to assault those fortifications. So we're going to take the bridges instead and prevent them from crossing over. I'm certain that you can handle a straightforward task such as that, can you not? Sure. Stay a moment. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, I have a little challenge for you, Baird Beam. Do you see all of those orc fortifications out there? They communicate with each other through trained runners, goblins usually, who carry messages from one to the another. Defeat those messengers and their communication will be disrupted. If you are fortunate, you might even capture a message or two from them, though they usually memorize the information they are supposed to deliver to avoid such issues. When you have done as I have asked, return to me. Alright. And you, my lady? Might you spare a moment of your time? We have little time here before more wounded arrive, or those who have been most sorely injured pass into the west. He hey. I was doing something. Get back here. Okay. My, my um, words, traveler. But we have not even had a chance to unpack our supplies as yet, and in the rush of the landing, those fools have mixed the bandages and other healers' goods in with the rest of the crates. I need you to find the bandages in among the other supplies, then see to as many of the wounded as you can, and quickly. Return to me when you have completed this task. 
Okay, um, I think I saw some more quest. Oops. Nope. Okay, none down here. Let's get these. And then I do see this one up here. Bum bum bum! Military supplies, so we need bandages. Okay. Have our military supplies. Okay. I hope these three are bandages because we're out of crates. Well, what the heck? Oh, this one too, then. Oh my go, we can't find the bandages. Maybe there's some up there. Let's go up. Brum brum, la ba da, do dee. Down down there, right? No. Okay, there's more crates up here. And we've got... Oh, I thought he was T-posing. <laughs> Fergrim's aid. Stay a moment. Beardbeam. There are a pair of orc fortifications defending the banks of the Anduin. One which they call Durber's Stazg lies immediately to our north. The other, Falug, a bit further to the south. One of our first objectives here is to eliminate these two fortifications so that our landing can continue unimpeded. We need you to bolster our, fo our forces attacking the encampments particularly the assaults upon their gates. You must choose one of them to assault. You cannot be in two places at once. Take its gate and hold it for as long as you can. We will send reinforcements there as soon as possible. Okay? Mind my words, traveler. The battle is well underway now, Beardbeam, but time is not on our side, and we must hasten the defeat of our foe by any means. The orcs and goblins here in the Merc Eves are driven by Uruk war leaders who drive them into battle. Without these strong leaders to threaten and lead them into battle, the rest will fall aside in disarray and fear of our strength. Take the battle to any of the Uruks whom you should encounter. Each one you defeat shall mean a swifter victory for us. Will you lend me your ear? The battle goes well thus far, Beardbeam, but the Orcs in the nearby fortresses are proving tenacious. It seems they have also laid in supplies for a prolonged siege, should it come to that. But we cannot afford to be tied down here for so long, or the might of Dolgador shall push us back to the, into the Anduin. We bid you fight your way into those camps and destroy their supplies. This will both weaken their defenses and ensure that none of them are able to retreat with valuable stores back to their dark tower. When you've completed this task, return here to me for further instructions. Alright, I need some more bandages. Just one. Okay, cool. Um, I've completed two things? What? Oh, three things. Oh no, these are people with the bandage. There you go. There you are. I'm not gonna read these because it's. Nay, go on. Get out of here. You have my thing. You're welcome. Go. There we go. Alright, got the bandages. What do you need? Your care for our soldiers is timely and much appreciated, Bear Beam. With some rest and healing, most of them should be able to return to Lothlorien to recover in a few days. Those who cannot, we shall be reunited with in the ages to come in the furthest west. Might you spare a moment of your time? A handful of our soldiers have gone missing, and I fear they may have been cut off from our forces during the initial rush of the assault. Keep a watchful eye out for any of them while you are out in the murk eaves, and lend them whatever aid you can if you do come across them. They are skilled warriors in their own right, but there are a great many orcs still roaming the area. Okay, we get legendary deed bestowed. Complete the final assault of the orcs. Okay. Complete quest in Southern Merkwood. This isn't like a. Oh. <laughs> this isn't like a part one. 
We just do ten. Okay. Odd, but okay. Stay a moment. Um. Oh, did I not accept it? Cause she walked away. Yeah. <laughs> All, right. All right. Let's head out. So again, this is like um, yeah, dynamic layers. This is like the beginning of Moria. Yeah, that's gonna be where the okay. There is gonna be a where we're just doing this right here for right now. Uh, and this is gonna change. This area is gonna change. Um, oh, cool. I'm here. <laughs> we're just lined up. That's awesome that they left a space open for the player. <laughs> That's really thoughtful of the, um... Oh, you know what? We can change... What does this look like? I need to find out. That's a neat horse. Um... What's one look like? That one's also very neat. Uh, so uh, there's two that I'm going between, though. This one. Beautiful. We got this from the story. Or, let me take a look at this. I actually don't know what this looks like. I just got it because... Oh my god. Gotta get into the light. <laughs> What light? There is no light. Um. Man, it's too green. Yeah, I think what we'll do is use the horse. So our honey goat is gone for now. That was our Moria exclusive one. We're gonna use this while we're running around. This white horse. For now. I really like the uh, sporting one though and I can't quite remember where we got it. Look, we fit in. Okay. All right, I'm so distracted. And you guys want me to deed. <laughs> you see the kind of nonsense I get up to <laughs> when I'm just playing the game. You think I'm going to be able to focus enough to deed. Uh-oh. Ah, hey. Little jerk. Boom! You need head count. Defeat enemies. Okay, we could do that one. No uh, virtue. Do the virtue. No, because this is a virtue thing. Okay. Very, very interesting. We don't need to kill- oh we- oh no, we don't need to kill a hundred enemies in the Mirkwood. That sh should almost be easy, I think. That, but I do have a warg deed. These? Good okay. guys. Man, I tell you what, not having name tags on- Oh! Whoa! Hey, guys! <laughs> Help! Orc and Uruk Slayer. Illuminator of Merc- Ooh, that's a cool title. I feel like the titles definitely get much better as you you've taken the gate now defend it. Uh, as you go through the expansions, the titles get really cool. And you know, not to say that we won't ever go back indeed on camera um, or in a video, but we're gonna want to like be in the state of mind to do that. Who's hitting me? I can't tell people apart here. Oh, we gotta do this for three minutes. Hold the gate against the enemy. Alright, I'm here. Holding the gate. Hey! Holding this gate, you. Ugh. 
Because there are some things I want to grind out. Like the Lothlorien um, reputation and stuff. I do want to get that done at some point. Just not in a hurry. And Final Fantasy has really just taken hold of my entire person. <laughs> you fled from the battle? No, I didn't. What? Did I go too far away from it? Did I gotta go pick it up again? I fled from the battle. Unbelievable. We gotta go get it again. Hold on. We're still in combat for some reason. So maybe you have to stay like inside the gate? I don't know, they were out there fighting stuff. Merkwood, you're off to a great start here. <laughs> Fled from the battle. Hi, right, can we get out of combat? Alright, they're lining up again. Mind Set. my words, traveler. Take the gate of one of the orc fortifications. Okay, as soon as we get out of battle. Like huh? the heck? Let's go on foot. We'll go back, and I'm just gonna stand in the gateway. And whoever comes, comes, and if the uh, elves need help, that's too bad. You sent something there? Yes. Where'd you come from? Oh, this is the person we were in battle with. Okay. Alright. Let's try this again. Falug. I'm taking the gate. Okay, I, d I do need to stand, like, right here. Okay. I can do that. You won't go running around willy-nilly. Hey, my dude. See the sky. <laughs> they do just show up here. Okay, we can't. Oh, I don't move too far forward. They might think we fled. doing out here brum, brum, brum. and then up here some more all right one more minute of this I'll do this just to Help with the deed and also get some <laughs> health back there. Oh, 
Dun, dun. Um, to the person who at, like told us about the deeds, when do you start feeling that? I think it was John who asked us in the comments. Start feeling it like in Rohan or because if, if this is being under leveled for deeds, I know we got like really good gear on. I mean, I'm feeling I'm feeling okay. <laughs> You've held the gate. Good. Finish them off and then move on. Obviously, now I'm stressed out about the deeds, and I don't mean to be. <laughs> I just, um, I'm, I'm trying to think of what's best for the, like the let's play of this, without having to get, dedicate hours outside of just recording, um, or starting up like live streams just to deed or something, because it's not really an option right now. I mean, I'd like our character to be amazing, but how bad is if he? How bad is it if he's not? <laughs> I guess. <laughs> All right, cool. Can we leave this gate now? Being attacked by this. I see crates to pick up. Okay. Good. Do these guys ever stop spawning I or kind of just stuck here? I think just keep coming and coming, man. That <laughs> okay. Yeah. Ever, can you come over here? Um, I get these guys because yeah, we'll get that guy too. And the this feels like um, launch day spawn rates. <laughs> so I was definitely here for that. this. Alright, are there more crates? <laughs> We're over here cheering and screaming. Okay. Right, maybe it was just that little area because they're having a battle for the gate. That's probably what it was. A chest? Okay. These ones. Ready? What's in the chest? Nothing real great. I bet we have to kill that big old guy over there. Then I want to check out what's on top of this. Irish war leader. up there and see if something is up there. I hear screaming. <laughs> I 
Okay, another war leader. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna actually use this. Let's use some cooldowns, you know? When else are we gonna use them? Did it not work? I guess we didn't need it now. We should say that. Oh well. Look at all the pets we have. That's so cool. Okay, we got supplies. We got war leader. Any other things down here? I wish I could zoom in on the map. No. So let's go over here. Up on our horse and head out of here. Bum, 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 bum. That's what it is. It, I, I feel like I had that problem on release as well. The gates of those just had non-stop spawn. <laughs> Which is good, like when there are a ton of players. Right now, not so much. Okay. Um... Looks like we have to hold this, maybe? Or help him? I don't quite know who this is. Because I, I gotta rescue some soldiers. This might be one of the soldiers we rescue. Ah, yes. It okay. Oh yeah. Be safe, my dude. Now we gotta rescue some people up here. Save me from an unpleasant fate. Last, these wounds will need to be tended to. I fear my part in the battle may be over before it is rightly begun. Poor guy. Alright, let's go get some more soldiers saved. Mmm, Bow. We see any up further. Any soldiers need saving out here? A dead soldier? Can't tell. It's just a rock. Oh, here, this guy. <laughs> it's just a rock. I did not ask for you to participate in this. You silence me. Alright, and then rescue the exhausted soldier over here. Hmm, he's down here. Okay. Because so I hopefully he's not up in that. Alright, exhausted soldier rescued. Do we have goblin runners? I could see. I think that's back there. Capture the western bridge and the eastern bridge. Where's the rest of it? Like we have a, a ton of stuff. Oh. <laughs> okay. Um. Oh, these bridges. Okay, we gotta go back down there. Whoop. I was on my horse. Alright, goblin runners. Need three of them. Earlier. I think these are the invisible guys that I need, these goblin runners. Okay. 
skirmisher. Furler. Oh. Common scout. Oh, that's not what I need. Don't have enough room. Uh oh. Oh, I see a runner. He's running. <laughs> Get back here, you. Come back here. So, can I just like stay on this road and some runners will come? Oh, dang, we got. Oh, yep. <laughs> that answers that. Okay. Give me more, give me more. More runners, please. See him. I saw him. Oh, didn't I see a guy running? Sure did. Oh! <laughs> They're running all over the place. Burn up, burn up, burn up, burn up, burn up, All right, cool. All right, we got those. Now we just need the bridges. And I think we're good on all the quests we currently have. We'll get this bridge first over here. Oh! Wait, didn't we capture this? But I got this one. Oh, the bridge. Bridge has already been destroyed. Wow. I see you hiding there behind the tree. Oh my god, his name's Tucker? We're keeping that name. <laughs> I just realized that. I don't think I've ever gotten on this mount before. Not really a Lord of the Rings name, but still enjoy it. What's this? A mushroom? Turn this on because we're. This bridge has also already been destroyed. Alright! Go back to base. Turn all these in. I don't know if that completes our expedition or. What? We'll find out. Oh, stop it. Of the horses in the background <laughs> that are T-posing. Okay. Um, before I turn stuff in. In these dark days, we, we must work together stuff. or flee. So, sell these. This look like. Eh. These look like. Meh. Oh, yeah, I got some furniture. 
I'm gonna save that. I need to put that in the bank. Mithril dust. I don't know what it looks like, so I, I don't care. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Uh, no. Sell our stuff for four gold there. Okay. Then we should loot these. And then I fear we are beset on all sides. Should have some more stuff to sell. That and that. And then we're good. Okay. Oops. Megavonin. The bridges were already down by the time you arrived? Typical orc cowardice. They cut them at the first sign of danger and saved us the trouble of even worrying about them for the moment. Alright, stick. Legendary up. Okay. What can I do for you? So, were you able to learn anything from the goblin runners? No? Do not fret, they are rarely entrusted with anything of import, and this stage of battle should not last long enough for anything we learned from them to matter much. Our main goal is to cut them off from each other and leave them disorganized, and in that, you have performed admirably. Cool. Then, I think the other ones get turned in up there, and then let me just make sure. Oh, there's one down here still? Oh, okay. What can I do for you? It seems that you have managed to recover our missing soldiers, Beardbeam. Excellent. We cannot afford to lose too many soldiers this early in the campaign. We have a hard road ahead of us still. Yes. Oh, you have another quest. Mind my words, traveler. Um, I fear a few of our number have been captured by the orcs, pathfinders who came across the river in silence before our attack to mark the landing spots and eliminate the enemy's sentries. Most of them have returned since we began our assault in earnest, but a few have not, nor have we seen, seen any sign of their bodies, which Yorks would have left to rot had they been slain. Thus, I must believe that they yet live and are held captive nearby, most likely in the central fortification upon Amun Anganed, as they have not had time to move prisoners to Dol Gudur. However, once we assault that fortress in earnest, they would most certainly kill any prisoners held there. If you could manage to get them out before then, the Maladrim would be in your debt. Rescue a captured soldier. Okay, we can do that. We'll turn these in. About to enter the first true battle. Of what will like well, first tribunal of what will likely be our last war in Middle Earth. Really? How can I be of service? Well fought, Bearbeam. Now that the enemy is pinned within those fortifications, we can work on destroying them all together. What well done, Bearbeam. You? Your skills in battle match even those of the Meladrum. With most of the Uruk leaders fallen, the remaining forces of the enemy shall soon be driven back to Dolgador. How can I be of service? The supplies have been destroyed. Well done, Beardbeam. Without those supplies of arrows and provisions, the orcs will not be able to hold out much longer. And the rest of our forces are coming ashore and moving further into the forest as we speak. Barring the gate. Stay a moment. We must ensure that the commanders in Dolgador cannot get reinforcements into the Merc Eves during our assault upon the fortress. Any large number of troops would have to come through the Gostanon, the gate upon the Rhone that leads to the east. The orcs still control it for now, but I am certain that we will soon capture it as well. For the moment, I need you to see that the gate is made useless to them. Try to jam the mechanism by which it is raised and lowered on the side. It will not slow them down for long, but by then our assault will be complete and the Merc Eves will be ours. Mind my words, traveler. We are nearly ready for a decisive assault upon Amun Anganed, but my men have warned me that the set of siege engines lies in wait, looking upon the steep pass that we must scale to take the fortress. To muster an assault under the reign of such dark engines would result in needless death. It might even cause our assault to falter. 
If we can destroy those engines before we begin the assault, the orcs will have no choice but to face us in battle, where our valor shall be proven prove unmatched. And will you lend me your ear? Problem has arisen for the Meladrim, my friend. Our forces are being harried by groups of war riders who are ranging throughout the Merc Eves. Normally, we, re we rely upon speed and our superior skill in battle to ensure victory, even when outnumbered. But the war riders' great speed allows them to harry the assault, uh, harry and assault my soldiers at will. We need you to help thin out their numbers and keep them at bay, at least until we have secured the Merc Eves from the enemy. When you have done this, return to me for further instructions. Okay, so we've got a new set of quests <laughs> to go and do, but we would do that in the next episode. Um, so yeah, uh, we did a lot today. We got the uh, expedition unlocked. We're in Merkwood, but we're still in like the phased part of it. So I'll do these in the next episode. Let me know what your guys' thoughts on the deeds are. I really do want to know. Um, it, obviously, you know, you can tell it's it's bothering me a little bit that we're behind on our deeds but uh, i i do not have the time or or will to go back and do them if we're not doing them recorded if you want to see some deeds let me know and i will try to maybe spread them out into episodes um so there are a couple options that we have but let me know what you guys would want to see the deeding i will tell you is extremely boring it's go and kill stuff it's go and find stuff um i'd be using guides i'd be just talking while we go kill like 100 enemies um, but we certainly can do that. Uh, I would just want to do it for you guys and not on my own because I, I have limited time. Uh, so let me know what you think. Um, but other than that, I want to thank you guys so much for all of your support on this series. Uh, I'm so happy that we're here for Mirkwood, and I hope you guys are too. Uh, if you do want to see more of the Lord of the Rings online Let's Play, make sure to leave a like or subscribe to the channel. Otherwise, I will see you guys next time. All right. Bye-bye, everyone.